Are you a fan page on Instagram? Do you like to use Pinterest? Are you a comic consumer who's mainly on social media for art? Do you sometimes put food in the microwave and forget about it till 30 minutes later? Are you a fan of Lil Nas X? I'm Lil Nas X. If you can relate to all of the above, credit the f***ing artist. Cause baby, yeah. you're a fire, your yeah. work. Yeah. Who gonna show yeah. me what yeah. it's yeah. worth? Yo, yeah. we can go. Yeah. Uh, oh shit. Sometimes I feel like I wake up on the wrong side of the bed. I'll feel like doing nothing until I pick up my phone and find some type of message or notification to give me a spring of motivation. But at the same time, there's barely anything that actually pisses me off. You wanna know what really gets my socks wet? <laughs> What I find hilariously bad is the fact that people will go out of their way to find and steal artwork, but instead of crediting the artist or saying nothing, they choose what they believe is the gray area in there. I don't know, maybe I'm a Scrooge, but seeing credits to the artist might be the worst option there in my opinion. And the funniest part is it seems so normalized on Instagram. Like this is just totally fine to stumble across and do with, well, next to no backlash. Sometimes I just be looking up Kitty Dog on YouTube and I see Kitty Dog traced me 100% original art. This happens all the time. People be re-uploading my shit, tracer fangirl murder videos, people claiming they invented kitty dogs and that I traced them. The list goes on. I wish I could invent kitty dogs. Welcome to the show, the show that everyone likes a lot, the show this that's really cool, beat. the show that's nice and I like, yep, this is a good show, let's go. <clears throat> Kitty Dog, Dream? I'm not a Minecraft YouTuber. How did you uh, start? With animation? Yeah, so in 2013 I- What are your thoughts on uh, borrowing your art? The fuck you mean? You know, like- <laughs> I think it's okay if I take your shit, because once you put it up on the internet, it's free game. It's public domain. Bro, artists work hard on what they do. You can't just do that shit. Then maybe artists shouldn't post their work. Then it wouldn't get stolen, right? A duck walked up. Stop cutting me off. To a lemonade stand and he said, the show is now over. What happened to the show? I guess we'll never know. Uh, what happened to the show? Well, g goodbye. Honestly, people rip off my shit so much that it barely even phases me anymore. I learned the meaning of the universe last month. How the fuck am I gonna get upset about some kids wanting attention for ripping off my art? I only really get pissed when my friends get ripped off, and I can be protected of them. Especially if their art isn't well known, but it's still fucked to rip off mine or anyone else's hard work. Was the clout worth it? Was the 55k views worth it? See, what I don't understand is how people can spend hours or even days on a product and random motherfuckers who are already stealing their content can't take five seconds to simply write a name or find the original artist. What do you do if you have a piece of artwork that you for some reason want to repost, but you don't know the artist? Don't repost the art, period. What I'm bitching about here is a lack of credit and just bullying artists, man. They have it so hard. You see little Timothy over there? Timothy's eight. He won an art competition in his school. Look at that stick figure. Would you steal Timothy's art? Just maybe don't repost the art, period. Why should you if it isn't yours? This is why I'm even saying this. We aren't asking for your holy water to be poured into a wine glass. We are asking when you steal a sweat's worth of work to just say who you got it from. Help little Timothy out man for real wow man what a cute piece of artwork it'd be a shame if how would you feel if i took your newest art piece right now posted it on main and said it was mine <sighs> at this point i'm barely phased by anything so go off i guess voila what's next you're gonna say i traced you no you killed me and you traced me shit's even worse when you cut out watermarks bitch and complain and put in the extra effort to be sneaky about it you took more time cropping or scribbling out their watermark than you did actually just writing their name bro why 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 are you so holeless you got that criminal smell on you i really do love when people just steal art as well like the ones that try to be secretive about it because you can automatically tell it isn't theirs it's the equivalent to a 
parent walking in on their child playing their DS under the covers. You could just see the bright ass light radiating from whatever device they're using. Red handed bruh. Period. Bro, speaking of DS, when I was a kid, I used to rip off others' flip notes too. Just make nothing but repetitive spinoffs. But then someone left a hate comment and I cried. I was like nine. And after that, I vowed to never steal others' work. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Very big achievement. Most of the people who do shit like this are kids, and I expect most of them to grow out of it. But sadly, I've seen some people enjoying that negative attention and keep doing it. Hopefully a majority of them stop though. Well, are you guilty of this? Do you feel bad about it? Here, give me a kiss on the cheek if you're my age or in that range. All is forgiven, honey. Just don't fucking do it again. And if you feel extra bad, here's a cheat code to make up for all your sins if you fail to credit or steal art. Find all the artists you know and send them $100. Yeah, just send them all a bunch of money. Empty your pockets. Make your wallet hurt. Magically, your artistic sins have been forgiven. Ball sack. Kobe. Oh, uh, yeah. I drew this. Awesome. I can't wait for you to get canceled. <laughs>